have you ever been in a situation whereby you don't have enough ingredients to cook your soup but you have vegetable at home come let me show you how you can make this amazing wonderful and delicious recipe soup come let me show you so you today's video i'll be showing you how to cook a budget friendly vegetable soup recipe and this is the ingredients i will be needing to cook this this is uh, my vegetable already sliced and this is uh, my beef meat with a small um bone and this is my dry fish white onions and red onions this is my crayfish and my maggi two maggi cubes and this is my stock fish and this is my hard chicken for cooking soup and this is my flesh for beef flesh so and this is the the spices i'll be using rosemary paprika uh, powder thyme and rosemary dried one and the ginger so guys keep watching let's get started if you want to know how to cook a budget friendly um vegetable soup recipe keep watching so i'll go ahead to add my pot on the fire uh, the first thing i'll be adding is the beef meat with the bone and i will add my hard chicken super horn and i will add my stock fish okay i will go on and add my uh, red onions white onions for the parboil we will first of all parboil uh, these things before we can start cooking i will add the spices in and my fresh rosemary i will go ahead to add one of the uh, maggi spices or maggi cube okay yeah because i need the water in this i will add a little bit of water a little bit and i will stir it okay so hi guys today is your first day see my channel thank you so much for stopping by i thank you so much because you just see other videos on the youtube platform you come to check my i say thank you so much I consider subscribing to our channel after watching don't forget to give us like share this video okay and check other of our old videos and uh, don't be, don't forget to give us a comment okay and my old subscribers in the house thank you so much for watching for your comment and for sharing God bless you so I will go ahead to cover it to cook for 20 to 25 minutes then I will come and check it. Keep watching, guys. So, guys, after 20 to 25 minutes, uh, you will can see that um, the beef and the superhorn have, have cooked very well. Okay, now we are going to add our um, the meat, the flesh meat. Okay. I've already washed it. So and we will add also our dry fish. Okay. We allow the other one to cook very well before we can add this one. We can now give it a stir. Again, do you see how it is? It looks so nice now, guys. Look at it. I like um, whenever I am buying meat, I like to buy the meat that have some bone. You, you can see this one here. <laughs> when you are eating, after eating, you have the bone to chew. Yeah, I love it so much. That's why you see this bone here. And this will be sweet, guys. So, I will add the bone now and I will stir it. I will add a small pepper in this. I will add herbs. I will add pepper. Yeah, this is optional. I have dried blended pepper. Okay. I want to add it now so that it can be cooking together with the the meat. 
because I'm cooking vegetable soup, I don't want to add another another water. The spinach is going to bring water, do you know? So don't add much. Just stir it, leave it. All this meat is going to bring bring water to cook the soup. So I will cover it to cook about 10 minutes again. Then we will come and check it, guys. Keep watching. So guys, after you have cooked for 10 minutes, I will come to check it again. You can see that our flash, our, our meat, have cooked very well and we still have water here down okay now we'll go ahead to add our oil red oil i'll be using red oil to cook this vegetable soup yeah vegetable soup need oil you can also skip this red oil if you don't want it i like cooking with red oil so i will go ahead to turn it I stir it very well and before I cover it, I will go ahead to add, you see here, I will add my crayfish and I will go ahead to add the rest of my Maggi cube. So yeah after adding the maggi cube i will also turn it very well so i will turn it very well yeah i will not add i will not add water guys okay i want this vegetable soup to be also sarcopu hmm? also sarcopu yeah so after turning it i will cover it again allow the oil to cook i will allow the oil to cook before i can add my vegetable so you can see how it is so guys keep watching so now we are going to come and check it um you see how it is now our soup is uh, about to done I will go ahead to add my vegetable but before I add my vegetable I have to remove this my fish uh, yeah <laughs> I don't want it to spoil here I need to remove it you can see there are two but the other one has spoiled so I have to remove this one here so that all of them will not uh, spoil okay that's the purpose of removing the soup uh, the fish out so this i do use my thickener a little bit thickener this is my uh archie i'll go ahead to make this archie soften this archie add it here uh if you have okra a little bit of okra can go very nice i went to buy okra today but i did not have i did not see okra and um, i have archie so let me use this archie for the thickener after um, after adding water i will i will be using i will be adding it here this actually will make this vegetable now to stay together they will not separate okay that's why that's the purpose of adding this actually so and as i said before a good um okra will be the best so now i will be adding my vegetable vegetable after i will be adding and be turning so let's just turn this one yeah i call this a budget friendly vegetable soup because you know vegetable soup you need to have a lot of vegetables and a lot of so uh, fish dry fish and everything okay so but this one i just to make it budget friendly it will not cost you much but you will still have the taste of vegetable and also it tastes so good and also healthy vegetable is very healthy yeah so I'll be adding and I will be also turning it, stirring it to enter. 
so you can see that our vegetable soup is about to done guys just tear it very well before you know it now this vegetable will disappear that's why i say we need much vegetable a lot of vegetable so that it will show okay i use two pack of uh, spinach this this two pack of spinach if i want to cook every uh, um, much enough vegetable soup i used to use four pack the four pack will bring out the vegetable soup in a wonderful way so you can see how it is now i'll go ahead to add uh, my fish here my dry fish and i will turn it guys and i will not forget to test for salt right. let me know what you think in the comment section are you going to try this budget friendly vegetable recipe whatever you have in your house as far as you have vegetable you can try it let me know in the comment section and thank you so much for watching don't forget to like please share and subscribe if you have not done so by now god bless you for watching you will see the outcome of this vegetable how oh, i can even cover it for a two minutes or a minute to cook and then it is done so this is the end of our video guys so our vegetable soup is done guys bring your fufu bring your amala <laughs> bring whatever you like to eat i like this bone in this okay bring whatever you want to eat let's just eat it thank you so much for watching my budget friendly vegetable recipe so this is the end of this video bye for now ciao